little breaking clutch kick. No e break there. There we go. Just bang that out in second gear. Definitely dried out now. Little clutch kick. There we go. Little breaking. We got it. All right. Tipsy cause I've been sipping on Henny I got the study of my vision And she ain't from the city And she ain't foreign and she boring Love the way you twerk it shot What's up everybody welcome back to the channel I'm Evil Rabbit here in my street tuned 240SX It's running about 427 horsepower Stock motor turbo Pretty much basically a street tuned car Stock tires and everything as well And I'm here today to do something I've been meaning to do for a while and that is not drift in the rain, but this is Forza Horizon 3, so it happens all the time. But to come into the settings and put steering on simulation, we're going to put cosmetic damage on as well. So I'm curious, and I want to try drifting in simulation, see how this goes. I don't know if this is going to go too well, but uh, especially because it's raining, but we're going to see. Now, I've tried it once or so before, but I didn't you know, really get that much into it. But so far, it doesn't seem too bad. So like I said, I, this is about 427 horsepower. Turbo stock motor. I'm going to get to the side and see what we can do in simulation. And already the rain's getting me. So the first feelings, though, the wheel feels a lot different. It feels more uh, free, I guess you could say. It's a little stiffer, but... I don't get that weird chatter like when I throw it back and forth like I do when I'm on normal and we're getting this we're definitely getting sideways that curb check not helping so we were getting a little sideways there for a little bit but you know like I said I want to try this on sim steering if you guys have tried sim steering before and you use a wheel comment down below let me know what you guys think about it the feel is definitely different but I am starting to kind of like the feel of it other than that but because it my wheel doesn't chatter like it does on the other one. I think that's because normal steering has the buffers and such. This one doesn't. There we go. Ooh, we got it now. Run that outside. There we go. The curve check. We're still good though. Ooh. See, it goes straight to understeer though. So that's definitely a different feel. But as you see, I can throw the wheel and catch it. And it actually rotates pretty nicely on the steering, actually. E brake. There we go. Going up this top. Crack the tail end on my brand new Street 240. If that's all I cracked, then we're good. All right, going to rip this around again. So I'm hoping it stops raining here soon so I can actually, you know, get some good drifts going. But it doesn't look like it's going to stop. So we're going to run it through the street a little bit here. So... But this is something I've been meaning to do for a while. Definitely want to try getting more into sim steering and probably stay on simulation steering. Probably be a lot harder in tandems and such, but something I'm willing to try to learn. There we go. Oh, I went into the wrong gear. Still having some shifter issues. I gotta sort that out. I haven't really had time. It feels nice though. When you actually get it going and sliding and you get it right, that's a lot of traffic. We go. Oh, it looks like it's gonna stop raining. So we're gonna turn back into the parking lot here. See if we can't get some dry drifting here on sim steering. There we go, a little backfire pop. There we go. Not as uh not as bad as I thought I was gonna be doing. There is a lot more steering wheel movement. Like right there, there's some understeer. There's a lot more steering wheel movement on sim steering, but I feel like my wheel is not like forcing itself back like it, I don't get the chatter I kind of I'm kind of uh, starting to like this actually so that it's finally drying up here we're gonna run up here and see if we can't run the little uh, section that we run maybe run the extended eight just a little braking clutch kick no you break there there we go just bang that out in second gear Definitely dried out now. Little clutch kick. There we go. Little braking. We got it. Alright, so definitely getting the handle of this here on 
sim steering. All right, let's see if we can run the extended eight section. This might be a little bit more than I can chew right now. Still on the stock transmission though. There we go, we break in. A clutch kick. Pull it out there, kick it back. There we go, ooh, right on that curb. We're good. Bob, we're gonna kick it back. Just left foot braking. No, no e brake there. There we go. More throttle. Oh, we have e brake that one. We're not really set up for that, but we kind of saved it somewhat. So, sim steering. Not as hard as I thought it was gonna be. I feel like this car is pretty dialed though, so. Rip through the streets a little bit. Oh, we're in front of the mini. This, uh. Suspension on this 240 is pretty dialed though, so I spent a lot of time trying to get this to handle well on you know stock tires and like a street to wreck it. As I say that I completely lose it. But I am having fun with this right now, so we're probably gonna go up to a drift zone and see how we do on a drift zone though. Because you know parking lot simulator it's a good test of it, but it's not like the only test. Ooh, sign tap. Because I feel like that would definitely be different. Oh, as I wreck into the wall. Alright. I'm going to hop over to a my favorite drift zone here. Let's see what I can do. On sim steering. I don't know. Kind of nervous about this uh, twin hairpins right now. We did repair our car though, so that's good. All right. Let's see how this works. Kind of nervous, but there is no drive tar since we are in an online lobby. We're gonna ease this in here. Oh, kick it in. Here we go. Okay, yep, see, that's exactly where Sim Steering got me. I was thinking I was on normal and I needed, didn't need to correct as much as I did. So I'm gonna run it back up the hill. Of course it's gonna start raining. Why wouldn't it rain? This is Forza Horizon 3, it always rains. Ooh, get a little squirrely there though. All right. Guys, again, be a little gentle on this though. Here we go. Try this again. We're gonna enter a clutch kick. See, corrected more than I needed to. Oh boy. So twin hairpin sim steering. Not my finest moments. Yeah, I'm correcting way too much, so I'm gonna have to get used to this a little more. If I wanna stay on sim. But I think it's time, we're gonna head back to the parking lot. I'm gonna try a different car and see how it feels on another car. So like I said, if you guys do some steering and you wanna let me know what I could do maybe to make it a little bit better, let me know down in the comment section down below. I mean, if it would stop raining, it would be awesome. Let's go with Let's go with the E46, the E46 life. There we go. All right. E46 parking lot simulator, 2017. <laughs> Oof. Oh shit. Ooh. Go. Oh my god, that wheel almost snapped out of my hands there. Ah, uh, not enough. Too much throttle though. Probably wrong gear, so kick back in the third, there we go. So more power is definitely touchier, but I think we got it though. Oh yeah. 
If you're not on throttle when you're countered, it will grip up. Now this car is on a higher tire compound, so no, I don't want to go to the festival. Let's try a different car here. I don't think I have any other cars on street tires. I think these are all on sports. Yeah, I think these are all on sport tires. So we're going to go with... Eh, we'll try the Mustang out. We'll try the GT350R. I think this is still on sport tires, but, er, but we'll see. I think uh, stock tires are definitely a way to go when you're going with some steering. For sure. Oof. So twitchy though on simulation. I gotta get used to that. I am on 900 degrees of rotation, so it's not it's not like I'm on a short rotation. Oh, grass is not my friend on sim. Nor is the rain. Okay, that's better. You definitely gotta keep the wheel spin going because as soon as the wheel spin dies, it's like in a real car. You're countered. You're you're going the opposite way of that counter steer. You're going into a wall. Ooh. This is very bad. Alright, a little bit better. Kind of getting a feel for it. Ooh, see? Went to go clutch kick it and lost all wheel spin and just straightened up massive. So, I don't think the suspension on these are as dialed as my other one. So, I'm going to go back to my 240 that I know has some pretty dialed suspension and because it's lower power I'm pretty much always on throttle I think that's why it slides easy on sim so I'm definitely gonna have to make cars that slide a little bit easier maybe change my suspension setup style so if you guys want to keep seeing sim steering here on the channel comment down below tap that like button we appreciate the support oops wrong gear so do one or two more final laps on this section here and then we're gonna end it on that note on the note of being able to slide this 240 on simulation steering and slide it pretty darn well actually Uh, I knew that was going to be too long of a knee-break grab. Oh, gear. Sim steering on a wheel. Definitely a challenge, especially in the rain. You're on Horizon 3. <laughs> Go. Don't need as, don't really need e-brake as much as I do on normal. It just likes to go around with just pretty much the brake. I think I'm gonna have to build cars more for weight transition and not make them as stiff if I wanna run sim steering, which I kinda wanna start running sim more, but I'm gonna have to get some, you know, try and get some tandems and see how this works. But of course, I'm not nowhere near fluid as much as I wanna be. So like I said, if you guys wanna keep seeing Forza Horizon 3, don't forget to tap the like and subscribe to the channel as well as you can follow me on Facebook, Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram. All of which are found in the description box below. This rain is way too much. It needs to stop. But it's Forza Horizon 3. So I think I'm just going to bear the rain, get some more practice on, maybe tune some more cars. So until next time, guys, I'd like to thank you for watching. I almost hit a tree. So I'm going to quit while I'm ahead. I'm Evil Rabbit, and I'm out. I'm loving, I'm tipsy cause I've been sipping on Henny I got the study of my vision and she ain't from the city And she ain't foreign and she boring, love the way you twerk it